So it seems you're kind of a big deal. <laughs> Thank you so, for noticing. <laughs> so I want to know how you got to where you are as like this kind of EF royalty, if you will, oh, thank you. size. So yes, very apropos. Tell me, what happened? How'd you do it? Um, so I've been traveling with the F since 2009, and maybe after five years of touring, I used to do tours every other year because I taught in a school that was much smaller and much low, much um, less income there. Mm -hmm. um, and my tour consultant reached out to me and said, hey, we really like for you to share your experience on these tours. Would you mind coming to Paris with us? And I was like, uh, of course I will. I would love to meet new people. I love traveling. Um, and so I went on my first training tour uh, to Paris, and since then, this is my 13th training tour and I love meeting new group leaders like you and staying in touch and helping them feel supported along the way and uh -huh. seeing their journeys on on social media or just like connect reconnecting somehow and seeing that they've had a great tour that their kids are having a good time or um, that's something that I said to them in a in a workshop really stuck with them it really brings me a lot of joy to be able to mm -hmm. connect with people in that way and then to continue um, the work that that you all have done um, to make sure that more kids around the world can really experience these amazing trips that are going to last a lifetime. I think sometimes some kids think that they don't deserve it, mm -hmm. but my goodness, like we all know that they do. Yes. We all know that they do. So just treating them the way that they, I don't know, the, the, treating them in a way that they never thought that they would get treated. Yes. It's so important. It's so important because of just all the struggles that they're going through at home, maybe they're not getting it for this or that reason and mm -hmm. we can provide that. Yes, exactly. That. Every human mm -hmm. being on this planet deserves the kind of opportunities that you get when you travel. And it's not just about like checking a place off your bucket list. It's about truly understanding more about yourself, mm -hmm. more about the world and more about yourself in the world that really allows students to find out what they like in life, find out what they like about themselves, find out what they want to do with their lives and what they don't want to do with their lives. Um, it's been really great to see some of the kids be like, oh, I want to be a flight attendant so I can just go <laughs> to more places in the world and other people telling me that they want to do like, um, green architecture because they, you know, when we visited sustainable cities like in Amsterdam, for example, they were just so enthralled with those kinds of things. So it's mm -hmm. also a really great way to inspire kids as well. So I'm so glad and I'm, thank you for saying that I inspired you. You, you do, because I see you. you and I hear your stories and I hear the conversations and all the stories that everybody has and the relationships that everybody has. So watching that has inspired me to keep, to keep going, thank you. you know, and I hope that when my students or the students that just didn't have enough encouragement or the enthusiasm to sign up and they're they're gonna miss out mm -hmm. you know what I mean they're gonna miss mm -hmm. out and I hope I hope that I hope that they see that <laughs> <laughs> but I mean in a way that will inspire them the way you've inspired me to just go for it to Thank take you so to much take, to take it